These are your Harvard University Top 5 Plays of the Week presented by GEICO. At number 5, women's volleyball. Early in set 1 against Cornell, first-year Lindsay Zhang made a diving save to keep the ball in, and first-year Rocky Aguirre then set it up for sophomore Nicole Prescott. She hammered down the cross-court kill for the Crimson. Prescott went on to record 14 kills against Cornell as the Crimson defeated the Big Red three sets to one. At number four, field hockey. Late in the fourth quarter of Harvard's 4-0 win over Dartmouth, a series of beautiful diagonal passes up the field led to a goal for senior Colby Keating, her first of the season after a great setup from Emily Guckian and Sarah Silzarska. The victory helped the Crimson improve to 11-1 overall and 4-0 in Ivy League play. At number three, football. In 19th ranked Harvard's 30-3 win over Lafayette, junior kicker Jonah Lipple connected on three field goals, including a 42-yarder in a tough wind late in the third quarter, giving Harvard a 23-3 advantage. Lipple is 6-6 six of six on field goals this year, helping Harvard to a 5-0 start, its best since 2015. At number two, sailing. In race 5A of the Women's Atlantic Coast Championship, the boat of senior skipper Emma Kennedy and sophomore crew Marley Belsley blew past the rest of the field to cross the finish line well ahead of the pack for what was the duo's second of three straight first place results. Kennedy and Belsley finished the regatta as the third ranked boat overall in the A division. At number one, men's soccer. On a free kick awarded to the Crimson, sophomore Willem Abinga sent a shot off the goalpost, setting up first year Alessandro Arlotti to drive a shot to the back of the net on the ensuing rebound. The goal was Arlotti's sixth goal of the season and helped the Crimson earn a point in a 2-2 draw against Brown. That's it for this week's top five plays. Check out the Ivy League on ESPN for more live and on-demand content.